Hey, Sitting Dev here. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to install Node.js and NPM, which is the Node Package Manager, the easy way. So let's just jump straight into this. Uh, we're going to be doing this on Ubuntu 20.04, um, which is the long-term support version at the moment. And as you can see, I'm actually on a Windows system here, um, but that doesn't matter because I'm using WSL2, so you can follow along what I'm going to be doing uh, at the command line yourself. So the first thing we want to do is go to the nodejs.org website. And once you're on here, um, come down to this part here and see where other downloads is and you're gonna click on that. Now, when you get to the bottom of this page, you want to click installing Node.js via package manager. And once you've done that, obviously we want to click on Debian and Ubuntu based Linux distributions. And you can see here that what we want to do is click on this link here. And that's going to take you to this same page here that I've already opened. So I'm going to close that one off. And we're here on GitHub. So we're going to scroll down. And you can scroll right down. It shows you all of the different distributions that this should work for. Um, so that's really useful if you need that. And now you can see the installation instructions. We're not going to be using the latest version um, in this tutorial. We're going to be using the long-term support version, which is this one here. So what we need to do is it's saying we need to use curl. So if you haven't got curl installed uh, or you're not sure, I'm going to show you how to double check and how to install it. So what you want to do is, is type curl dash dash version and that's going to then give you a version number if you're using curl. Now, if this doesn't come up and it's not installed, then the way to install that is pretty simple. Just do sudo apt install curl. And you can see that it's already saying to me that the newest version is installed, so it hasn't gone and done that, but that's perfectly fine. So we'll clear that out. Now, coming back to this page here, the first thing we want to do is obviously take this command here. And this is the easy way of doing it with curl, by the way. There is another way where you can do it more manually, um, but this is still fairly manual, and I'd say it's probably the best and easiest way for most people to install it. So just copy that and then head back into your terminal. And now all we need to do is paste that first command in, hit enter. You might need to add sudo onto it, um, depending on way that you're running your system at the moment and now that is done so what we do next is go back to the github page and now we need to copy this command which is probably one that you can memorize uh, off the top of your head but hopefully you're not going to be having to install node.js all of the time so get that code and then head back into your terminal then paste that one in as well hit enter and that's going to install what we've just downloaded because we've obviously downloaded that and we've updated uh, the package version to the one that we wanted. So now that we've done that, what we need to do is type node dash dash version. And you can see there that we've got v14.15.5. So that's the right one. And we can also check npm as well because npm uh, in this instance comes installed with node.js the way that we've installed it. So that's it, that's all you have to do, it's really simple. I'm gonna leave the links to those two sites down below so you can check those out. So that's it for this video. 